Be glad and exult with all your heart, O daughter of Jerusalem. The Lord hath removed the judgment against you. He has turned away your enemies. The King of Israel, the Lord, is in your midst. You have no further misfortune to fear. On that day, it shall be said to Jerusalem, Fear not, O Zion, be not discouraged. The Lord your God is in your midst, a mighty Savior. He will rejoice over you with gladness and renew you in his love. He will sing joyfully because of you, as one sings at festival. The Word of the Lord. The approaching celebration of the Christmas event should fill us with explosive and contagious joy. In today's passage, St. Paul's exhortation to the Christian of Philippi is most appropriate also for us. Let us listen to the second reading. A proclamation from the letter of Paul to the Philippians. Brothers and sisters, rejoice in the Lord always. I shall say it again, rejoice. Your kindness should be known to all. The Lord is near. 
have no anxiety at all. But in everything, by prayer and petition, with thanksgiving, make your request known to God. Then the peace of God that surpasses all understanding will guard your hearts and minds in Christ Jesus. The Word of the Lord. Amen.